Hi everyone, Joe for jazpyscasebreaks.com coming at you with a brand new release, 2020 Panini Chronicles Draft Picks Football, eight box, uh, half, it's a half case break, eight box break number one, random team break number one. You get random college football teams right here. So we sold 21 spots and we comboed a bunch of universities here as well. So it's gonna kind of look jumbled on the random screen but there'll be 21 items and we can match everybody with everything. So I think we'll be good. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. Congrats to the winners right there. Um, you have a little rooftop next to your name if you won those spots in a previous mini break. I think it was 2013 Select Football. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Each list, six and a four, ten times. One, two, three. And 10th and final time. After 10 times, Chris Parent down to Troy Rimmer. Paste you right there. All right. Um, also, if you want to trade, you have to trade that entire block of teams for another block of teams. You can't just pick one university out and then another university out and trade those. You've got to trade the entire block. All right. Six and a four, 10 times for the teams. One. So there's 21 right here. Perfect. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And 10th and final time. After 10 times, we got the Utah State Aggies down to the Oklahoma Sooners. So hopefully this copies over nicely. There we go, perfect. I just want to spot check that, but I think we're good. Perfect, nice, that worked out. All right, so it's, I know it's kind of small here. I'll kind of, Chris Parent, you'll have the Utah State Aggies. Michael Mary with the Golden Eagles, Stanford, that entire block. I'll share this, uh, this list with you in just a second. Georgia, Colton Carver. How's it going, Colton, Patrick, Sean, there are your block of teams right there. Dennis, Anthony, Tyler Morris, Patrick, Colin with the Ti LSU Tigers, Alan, Mike, Michael Gallucci, Anthony, Justin I uh, with Iowa, and et cetera, et cetera. Wester, Darji, Kurt, Colton, Ron, and Troy. And Wester looking for uh, that Clemson and uh, USC group, by the way. So Ron would... Oh, he's got them up for trade. So there you go. Also, let me see. Let's share this with you. Just We just want you to view. We don't need your comments or your edits. Copy that link. So the link to the spreadsheet is in the chat if you're watching live. Now while you're considering your list and considering trades, remember the checklist was in the chat too. I'll drop the checklist again now that you have your teams. And, and I'll flip back to that screen in just a second. All right, let's open up this case right here, right? Chronicles, draft picks. Let's open up this case and we'll see which half we're gonna do. Like four on the left side, four on the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, eight, by the way. We're doing eight box breaking. Eight on the left, eight on the right. All right. We're going to select a die. Tice, what's going on? Tice, pop in the house. So we'll do one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. Four. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we'll, I'm sure we'll do this later tonight, but I'll, I'll still mark it. All right, so we'll just put a big Wolverine slash mark right there. So you know it's from the same case. I'm sure we'll do this later tonight. All right, let's flip 
back to this screen right here. And uh, I'm gonna pause the video, allow people to kind of digest what teams they have and check the checklist and see if they want to trade or just get a, get a good idea of what they're looking for. And when we come back, we'll have the break, so stick around. All right, welcome back, folks. So a little bit of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. So I know it's kind of hard to get all this on one screen, but everyone has access to that, uh, that link to the spreadsheet right there. So we'll just roll with that. We're going by the uh, checklist. I mean, some of these, I don't know. I haven't memorized where everyone goes yet, but all right, let's see what we got. Chronicles, eight boxes, collegiate, three autographs per box. It's kind of a cool design right there, on the inside of the box. All right. Nightmare from no. This is this is a breeze. It's it'll be a nightmare for the shipping team. folks remember all cards ship so I'm gonna just in the interest of time I'm gonna kind of breeze through most of this unless we hit like some of these significant quarterbacks right here like Joe Burrow Justin Herbert and Tua and then obviously I'll we'll top load the hits right away And everything will ship, and everything that's numbered will be will be sleeved and top loaded as well. I'll try to pull those aside as we go along, unless they're on the backs of the cards. I don't think they are. And our first hit is going to be Jonathan Taylor, 102 out of 299. Jonathan Taylor. It is going to be a Colt. A Colt. No, we're going by college teams. I don't, do they not have a college team checklist? Sorry. Right. Let's see if Group Rate Checklist has it arranged by college team. No, they don't actually. Usually they add the, the college team to it. All right. Well, we'll just go to cardboardconnection.com. Wait, we're doing the. I'm I'm so back. I'm so upside down right now. You're right, Wester. I'm losing my mind. Wisconsin is where he goes, and that goes to Darji. I blanked and I thought we were doing pro teams for a second. I was like, wait, we're doing college teams. It's been a long week, folks. There's Cole McDonald. Had a farm. A Hawaii Rainbow Warrior. That will be... Who's got Hawaii... It's all on one page here. There we go. Uh, Hawaii is going to be for Patrick. Losing it, folks. Still have one more day to go. AJ Dillon. Boston College. That will be for Mike. And Tyler Johnson to 25. Nice. That looks pretty cool. Three color jersey and autograph for Minnesota. Who I think are the... 
they, are they golden gophers maybe? I think they're on my list here. They are golden gophers. Anthony with that one. Anthony V. Jason L, what's up? Spectra, oh, Spectra thick stock like normal. No, they actually changed it up this year. Now it looks more like old Spectra, like 2013 Spectra. Callie, what's up? So uh, Jason L, there there are a few uh, there are a few like. Like one thick card, like normal, spe like like more recent Spectra, and then like maybe like a Prism thickness kind of card. A couple of those in there too. So yeah, if you go back, if you well, if you look at our videos from uh, this recent Spectra basketball, you'll be able to get you'll be able to see what it looks like. You get an idea of the the stock. We got Jerry Judy. I thought he was going to be autographs. Joe Burrow, is that, are you numbered Joe Burrow? Yeah, 74 out of 99 for LSU. That'll go to Colin. My guess is that uh, there's DeAndre Swift and Lynn Bowden Jr. for my Raiders. Goes to Kentucky. Um, my guess is that some of these That some some of these cards for Tua and Joe Burrow, even Herbert, are going to go for, going to go for a lot on the secondary market, just on its own. Especially if uh, maybe if they grade out nicely. Sixty-two out of one ninety-nine, Brandon Ayuk for Arizona State. That will be for Ron Holland with Arizona State. There he, there he is again. And C.J. Henderson, Florida C.J. Henderson, 62 out of 99. Florida, that will be... That's the Georgia, Florida, Virginia combo. Colton Carver with this guy. There's Denzel Mims, a Baylor Bear. Let's see if I can just spot Baylor on my list here without having to look it up. Nope, I'm gonna have to look it up. Baylor is gonna go to Patrick. By the way, Cali's finest. I gotta. I gotta see if there's uh, any PS4s at your shop. If you're still listening. On the hunt. Eno Benjamin. Three color patch and autograph. Another one for Arizona State. That's for Ron Hollins. Yeah, this is kind of a... 97 out of 99. Um, yeah, this is kind of a schizophrenic set. It's all, all over the place. But it is cool because you kind of get you, you kind of get a little bit of everything. It's like a buffet, a little sampler platter of all sorts of different sets. And I think it's gotten. I think people have really liked the Chronicles because it used to just be Chronicles football and baseball, maybe. But then they did draft picks, and then they did Chronicles soccer, I think. And they really started tightening up the design, and so they've been they've been putting a lot of attention to this set. 
And sometimes you'll get a baseball or basketball or football set that, that they've never done before. So like, I think it's like kind of like a sneak peek at what could happen in the future as well. Curtis, I don't know what Warzone. Are we playing Warzone? I'm getting I'm getting a PS4 so I can play the new NASCAR game. Is basically the reason why. Maybe I don't know. Maybe uh, I don't know. That's basically it. All right, Prison Raider. If you go to Beckett. Grading or um, Beckett grading or PSA grading. That's the th those are the two major grading services if you want to get your stuff graded. Warzone is a free Call of Duty of uh, Fortnite. Yeah, I'm kind of not into the only Call of Duty game that I ever played with some somewhat regularity is an old World War II version one. I, I think they did a recent World War II version one, which is what I play. I don't I don't like all the modern stuff. There's Justin Jefferson for LSU, 40 out of 299. Fabric of the game, going to Colin. But I'm not a big, not a big video gamer, so I've never, I've never played any of the Maddens, or any of the sports games, or anything like that. I'm not prepared for the learning curve to learn how to play those games. To 99, we've got Colby Parkinson for Stanford. Um, who has Stanford? That'll be for Michael Mary. Yeah, and I but I definitely want to drive around in a circle. Yes. There's road courses too. There's Van Jefferson in that prestige design. It's pretty cool. Uh, for Florida, that's going to go to Colton Carver. Speaking of Madden, Mike Tower says earlier, Ruggs is the top rated, rated rookie receiver in Madden 21. All right, hopefully they didn't jinx it. But Curtis saying saying people drive around in a circle is 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 wildly ignorant. There's ovals. There's triangles. There's circles with shorter turns. Circles with longer turns. There's a raider right there. Three color patch and autograph, Brian Edwards. There are half mile circles, mile circles, mile and a half circles. 65 out of 75 for South Carolina. He is a cock, game cock that is. That'll be for Allen. There are super speedways. There are races with extreme banked turns, non-banked turns, flatter tracks. There's an extreme amount of strategy and different setups for every race. For every single race. Egg shaped, there's an egg shaped course. I forgot what the egg shaped course is. There's a track that's like an egg. What's up, Buzz? On road courses, yes, they can turn left and right. So that means the. Uh, you could probably use the same uh, the same springs on the left and the right side.
Um, I find it, I primarily find it relaxing <laughs> because you don't have to think about anything. You're just like, oh, I just got to hit my racing lines and I got to hit the, hit the turns and you just kind of zone out and you just, you just drive and it's, there, there is a relaxing element to it. I don't have to think about strategy. I don't have to think about, you know, I don't have to think about, oh, what do I have to do in this mission? Fabric of the game, T. Higgins for Clemson. That'll be for Ron. That's the dream, Mike Tower. I don't know how much that kind of stuff caught. We may have to. There is a uh, there is a dirt track in uh, in Orange County, just about in 45 minutes south of us. We may have to start there. We may have to start sponsoring some dirt track racer. There's Jeff Okuda for Ohio State. That'll be for Kurt. We may have to start there, and then maybe work our way up the ranks. You know to midget cars maybe I think is maybe I don't know what the how, how one's progression would go I think it's all different but maybe some outlaws cars maybe uh, some other stuff Miss Jalen Hurts nice Oklahoma that's out of 15 Oklahoma Sooners that's for Troy And then what is what what isn't PC? Curtis, you know. And then we'll then maybe we'll get get to sponsor a truck series car, truck series truck. Maybe then then we can upgrade to sponsor an Xfinity car, and then a Cup Series car. Ooh, there's Keyshawn Vaughn, seventy three at seventy five, two color jersey and autograph. I like that. What is this? Phoenix design here is pretty sharp. Vanderbilt, Vandy, where where are you at on my list? Can I find you just by eyeballing it? No, I can't. Not Vanderbilt, but Vanderbilt. That will be for Anthony Piggott. Kind of hard to see the autograph. There it is. Are you numbered? Yeah, seventy-three out of seventy-five. We were a racing sponsor. That'd be a lot of fun. And Mike Tower, why would they put Henry Ruggs? Why would the Madden people put Henry Ruggs as the top? Rookie wide receiver, top Raider rookie. I feel like that sets the bar too high. And then the Raiders start feeling themselves. Henry Ruggs is a target on his back. You know, now now defensive backs are like we gotta shut that guy down. Ugh. Is that huge Bowman mixer gonna run later tonight? Yes. I don't, know, some of these, I don't know how many of these cards are numbered or not. I guess I should just sleeve all the ones I find. An all-card ship, folks. I know this is kind of a lot, a lot of different stuff in this break, but all cards will ship just because it's so unique. So anything I miss or a numbered card I miss, either a shipping team will find it or... Uh, or I'll find it, but everything will, will all ship. All right, there's Jalen Ragor, TCU, from an old Crown Royale design. I like that. 137 out of 199. They need to really seriously bring back Crown Royale, I think. I think that would be pretty cool. All right, TCU. Uh, oh, I found it. Michael Mary with the Horned Frogs.
Yeah, Tice. I mean, if we if we have a if, if we end up getting a cup car. But yeah, maybe get your company on there, Tice, as a sponsor. There's Isaiah Higdon from Oregon State. Uh, that goes to Ron Hollins. Matt and Mike Tower saying read that it's because Ruggs is the fastest rookie receiver and they put a lot of value on speed. All right, gotcha. Cam Green Acres on card Spectra autograph. That looks pretty sharp. And that is for Florida State. Uh, I thought I saw Florida State. Where guys? Where are you now? Florida State Patrick. With that, I think he's on the Rams. It's supposed to be the Todd Gurley replacement there. Donovan Peoples-Jones, 39 out of 99. Two-color jersey and autograph. That Phoenix design for Michigan. Justin Purnell with the Wolverines. All right, a few more boxes to go, folks. Brand new release, second half in the store. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Players do care about their Madden ratings, right? I, I always see interviews where like, do you guys care? It's like, yeah, I care about my Madden rating. Players tweet about it if they don't like it. If they don't like their Madden rating, they're like, what? Keyshawn Vaughn to 190. That Herbert was to 10. Let me grab that too. Keyshawn Vaughn for Vanderbilt. That'll be for Anthony. And Oregon. Where's Oregon on my list here? Oregon, that's for Dennis. So you've been getting a huge stack of a nice, well, maybe not a huge stack, but a nice size stack of Justin Herbert cards. I think this might be the first numbered one, and it's a pretty low one too. 7 out of 10. It might go for a decent decent amount. Not sure how these young rookies are doing football price wise on a secondary market, but I gotta imagine the first round quarterbacks that are slated to start this season are definitely gonna get some love. They generally do from season to season. Isaiah Coulter. Um, that's, there's no college on. Where, where did uh, Isaiah Coulter? Where'd you go? To the Google machine. Rhode Island. They didn't. Ha they don't have the Rhode Island license. <laughs> uh, that goes to Allen. Do I not? Unless I'm blind. No. I didn't. All right, Alan Murdoch, there you go. They got everybody else, but. Rhode Island said, <laughs> yeah. 
Allen try, tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. And he's going to give that, that group, of, group of teams away. Watch, he becomes a Hall of Famer, and everyone's like, looks back years later and goes, Made that trade with Allen. Dude, they didn't get the Joe, uh, the Rhode Island license. One of one, Tyler Johnson. Nice, our first train whistle out of here. Minnesota, Anthony V. Anthony, nicely done. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Yeah, they got to re really make a serious effort to bring Crown Royale back, I think. Yeah, so that was a nice, nice set. It's another Tua right there for Alabama. And we got Michael Pittman Jr. from USC, two-color jersey and autograph. And that's another try-to-trade, couldn't-trade mojo team, Ron Wester. Have that Clemson USC combo. That's 31 out of 49. All right, two more boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Second half in the store. Now that I kind of got into the groove, it's kind of a rough start of this break. Now that I got into the groove of this break, I feel like the second half will be a little more, a little more quick. So get into the action. Let's lock it in to the schedule tonight. Speaking of the schedule, how many orders do I have now? The order list is growing. We're about got 70 orders to go through after we do uh, a quick mosaic pack break and then a jumbo pack break, just to give away some spots. And we'll go through some orders and we'll just add uh, any other sold out breaks to the list. Now, generally we run till around nine o'clock Pacific, but sounds like, sounds like if you get your breaks locked in early, we'll keep it going. So get in early and often, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you get your break locked in. And we'll keep chugging along. All right, and there's Tyler Johnson from Minnesota. Make myself some room here. I need more. move on got some more space to operate now all right there's Jawan Jennings a Tennessee volunteer that will be for Michael Mary
And we've got, ooh, that's a Raider right there, Lynn Bowden Jr. For Kentucky, for my Las Vegas Raiders. Where's Kentucky on my list here? That goes to Justin. Two out of, just a couple off a train whistle, but pretty nice. Pretty dynamic player. Heard a lot of Kentucky fans say uh, he's going to be pretty exciting. Is this the best wide receiving class that we've, I, I guess as a group, that we've seen in a long time? There's Jersey and Autograph. Brandon Ayak, Arizona State. It's for Colton. I feel like there were a lot of first round wide receivers, more than usual, and, and carrying more hype than usual. Because I feel like we haven't had a wide receiver that everyone wanted to like, I don't know, to collect and be really excited about in a minute or two. Maybe this is this is the year, the year of the the wide receiver. All right, final box. I mean, quarterbacks are always going to be the most popular in terms of collecting. People love running backs too. But like I said, I feel like when's the last big wide receiver that everyone was super hyped about? That was in like the top the top five of rookies that everybody wanted to collect. I don't think since probably since uh, Odell Beckham Jr. in like 2013 or 14. So it's been a little while. Have to see what happens on the field, but a fast start by one of these top rookie receivers would be would be good. It would be hashtag good for the hobby, like this guy maybe for my Raiders. KJ Hill to ninety nine. I think they say Lynn Bowden Jr. may need a little more. Could need a little more seasoning and a more clearly defined role before they can really unleash his talents. But Henry Ruggs Jr. Can, might be able to get out of the gate early. Andre Swift and Zach Moss out of 199. Rookie Silhouettes Relic. And there's Darnell Mooney, rated rookie. The Tulane Green Wave. Tulane Green Wave. Anthony Pickett with that one. Curtis saying Brashad Perryman will make a big splash with the Jets this year. You heard it here first, folks. Dust off your Brashad Perryman. Could be a late bloomer in his NFL career. Brian Edward, that's another Raider right there. And Zach Moss again. A Utah Ute. Where are the Utes on my on my list here? Anthony Pickett with the Utes. Ben, you haven't heard Kanye's We Major in years until I played it? That old Kanye is is, is profoundly good. You got Nas on that track too. Not stuck in your head for the last 40 hours? I'm sure it'll show up on the playlist at some point tonight. Oh, we made you? And we got two out of 10, AJ Dillon. Two color jersey and autograph. Boston College, Boston College, what are they, Eagles? I think they're Eagles. Yeah, Boston College, Mike Ludwig with that. Do they, do they say War Eagle? Or is that just Auburn, who are Tigers, but they say War Eagle? Two out of 10, it's in like a fight song or something. 
All right, and Justin Herbert at the very end. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Nice little break. This, this break was a little long, so let me go grab the other hits and uh, let me show you. Let's do a quick recap here at the end. All right, so here is that first first block. Players right there, that one of one, Tyler John. Uh, yeah, that one of one, Tyler Johnson, right? Yeah, it was pretty nice, Rhode Island. That out of 10, Justin Herbert. So second half is in the store, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty nice set. I hear a lot of good things about Keyshawn Vaughn as well. We haven't seen the big quarterback names like Tua and Justin Herbert and Joe Burrow especially, but there's a nice stack of uh, Joe Burrow, Herbert, and Tua cards among others, all cards ship. And a lot of fun designs right here, too. So go check it out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe, and I'll break more with you next time. Bye-bye.